on guys i'm back with another installation video for the new power wagon grills and the j45 grills super simple installation the only thing you will need is a reamer or a 1 16th of an inch drill bit uh pretty straightforward and really simple installation uh the power wagon grill just pretty much sits in place and you just hold it in place drill in your holes and screw it in you, that calls it pretty much done supplied with this one will be m2 by six millimeter screws and nuts for the j45 it's also super simple uh, let me see rotate my camera here real quick so this one pretty much just holds in place you have these two stock holes so the new grill covers those and you drill in your your four corner holes right here to hold it in place and that's pretty much it it's done uh, now for the power wagon let me set this body right here so for the power wagon you have it here like this you set it in place and you align it see right there just drill it in right there on the opposite side and these two front holes right here are optional there will be hardware supply for these as well but you know like I said it's optional <clears throat> on our root beer build uh, we did a scale hardware so something if you guys want to look at into that and one other thing is that you guys notice that this body right here is trimmed. These slots right here are to trim your your grill. It's a pretty simple task. I will grab some nippers and show you guys real quick. So you see there so if I wanted to trim it here I believe this one sits right below the uh, what's it called the bottom the bottom piece right here you see right there and this piece right here would be if you run it really really short if you trim your your grill really short but i'm gonna show you real quick it's pretty much this is aluminum guys so it's really easy to clip so you just clip it so there we go that part is done and then you simply just take a file and then just file it down. Now one other thing guys, you guys can see that these are dull. These will not be cleaned. These will be shipped out like this if you're buying it raw. It's really simple to clean these. Uh, you can see this one right here. I simply ran the grill through a scotch brake, and I ended up with this result. If you wanted to polish it, then that will be... Uh, another step for you guys to do but um uh they will be powder coated and um our powder coated is textured which means that if you wanted to spray it any color that you guys wanted you can just spray directly over the powder coat no prep needed and let me go ahead and clean one of these for you guys so this is a scotch bright you can find this at mcfaddendale or I'm pretty sure you can find it like at Ace Hardware or any other hardware store. So this is really simple. You can do this the same with the J45.
you can see there it's starting to clean up. There you go guys. So, I hope you guys enjoy.